शुक्ला ब्रह्म विचार सार परमाद्याम जगद्व्यानी वीणा पुस्तकधारिणी अभयदाम जाड्यांधकारापस्ते स्फाटिक विदधती पद्मासने संस्थिता वंदे तां परमेशरी भगवती बुद्धि प्रदा शारदा दत्वा सरस्वती देवी सिद्धा गुण्याम कौम्यहम पाणिनीय प्रवेशाय लघु सिद्धांत कौमुदी So we looked at in Achchandi. The last sutra we looked at is Eko Savarne Shakalasya Raswascha. Before this, we saw the uh, uh, Pragruyam Sanya, and uh, that was also for that uh, those Nipatas which become Pragruya or something else which become Pragruya, they take Prakriti Bhava and thereby uh, either optionally or compulsorily they avoid Sandhi. That is Prakriti Bhava. They remain as they are in the as they are as in the the sandhi does not take place. And Eko Ekaha Asavarne Shakalase Raswascha said what Ekaha Asavarne Shakalase Raswascha Padantat becomes Padantasya uh, by Vibhakti Parinama and it's the Laghuvrati said Padanta Ekaha Raswaha Vasyu. So optionally. Uh, why because shakalya se matena therefore optionally uh, they ikah hraswa sihu they become hraswa asavarne when asavarna ach follows asavarne achi pare when an asavarna ach follows that time alone it can take uh, this vibhasha of taking hraswa and hraswa vidhi samarthyat na swara sandhi after it takes a hraswa uh, adesha that time uh, the swara sandhi should not take place otherwise uh, see this is a uh, this is something which has been derived by laghukara or any one for that matter any vyakarana will derive the meaning otherwise there is no meaning of giving a hraswa adesha because whether it is a hraswa dirgha pluta when they undergo an ach sandhi swara sandhi means ach sandhi when they undergo sandhi then the form is same whether ikara where chakri whether this chakri is dirgha or hraswa chakri then chakri followed by atra or chakri followed by atra you will still get yakara you will get uh, ekoyanachi and thereby chakratra if you do a sandhi therefore what he says when it takes a hraswa chakra uh, chakram asti asti chakra chakram is a sudarshana chakram sudarshana chakram asya asti iti matu parthe ini pratyaya and when any pratyay is added you will get uh, chakrin as a pratipadikam and in pullinga it will take dirgha so you will get and nakara lopa nakara lopa by nalopa pratipadika antasya nakara which is at the end of the pratipadika and at the end of the pada or maybe another sutra but this is the main sutra where nakara lopa will happen and you will get chakri so this chakri dirgha whether chakri hraswa if it takes hraswa adesh and you do sandhi then what is the point of this sutra at all because anyway you will do sandhi and when you do sandhi that time you will get chakratra you will get chakratra this form you will get therefore there is no meaning of making hraswa giving a hraswa adesha by this this uh, sutra eko asavarne ikah asavarne shakalase hraswascha so therefore this is vachana samarthyat vachana samarthyat or hraswa vidhi samarthya hraswa vidhi is the vachana elsewhere uh, it is said vachana samarthyat meaning sutra samarthyat because that sutra exists therefore you have to understand that this chakri atra if you do then you should not make sandhi so when you get this chakri atra form optionally that time chakri atra has undergone chakri dirgha and atra has undergone ekoyanachi uh, vidhi otherwise the vidhi would have been hraswa and if it takes hraswa then further hraswa vidhi samarthya meaning vachana samarthya or sutra samarthya since the sutra exists this sutra exists which would otherwise not have been needed therefore and what is the sutra the sutra says hraswa vidhi it gives hraswa vidhi therefore hraswa vidhi samarthya due to the capability of the vachana sutra which is giving hraswa vidhi 
therefore swara sandhi should not be done after this this is where we saw an example of padanta also why padanta has been said because elsewhere during the prakriya avastha prakriya avastha means during the derivation this sutra does not come into play and derivation meaning what pada derivation gauri plus au so gauri plus au supratya when you add prathama dvivachana that time if it takes hraswa then it will become gauri it will become hraswa but here gauryo you will get this here hraswa it does not take hraswa at all and why hraswa it does not take because if it takes hraswa then you cannot do sandhi further hraswa vidhi samartya sandhya bhava so swara sandhya bhava so swara sandhi you cannot do if it takes hraswa otherwise the question would be that if it takes hraswa gauri or gauri let it take hraswa still you will, you will get gauryo no you will not get gauryo because uh, if you apply that sutra which does not come into play when padanta is not there and if you apply it you cannot do further sandhi therefore padanta iti kim there gauryo example is given as a counter example whenever you see in kashika or in elsewhere in uh, padanta iti kim means apadanta example is given apadanta example is gauri plus au so this is where we were next sutra is achorahabhyam dve achorahabhyam dve sorry just remove a bookmark link achorahabhyam dve what does it say अचह रहादेश बिकम्स टू वॉट बिकम्स टू अचह अचह कैन बी पंचमी और षष्टी एक वचन ऑफ अच हियर इट इज पंचमी एक वचन आफ्टर आफ्टर दी अच रहाभ्याम रहाभ्याम इज रेफ हकाराभ्याम Reha and Hakara is there. Dwandwa, Rahabhyam, and Rahabhyam can come in Dwivachana of uh, in Tritya, Chaturthi, and Panchami. So what is this Rahabhyam Dwe? Here it says Acha Rahabhyam Panchami Dwivachana. So after an Ach, the Reha and Hakara. So Reha and Hakara should be following an Ach, and Reha or Hakara should be following an Ach, and after that what? something so that we have to look at anuvrutti this is the sutra in tripadi 8443 actually if you look at it only because this ach is coming over here and in this uh, sequence of example of gauryo there he has brought in this sutra but really if you look at it, it is not ach sandhi it is uh, sandhi when ach is in play but the sandhi is Uh, if you look at the meaning you will see that uh, the adesha neither the adesha nor the sani is an ach here so let's go to uh, ashtadhyayi and see 8446 so 8446 is hal sandhi prakaran it is actually a hal sandhi 8446 uh, from 8440 the hal sandhi continues here to 8446 achorahabhyam dwe this is our sutra so achorahabhyam dwe what is uh, dvitva prakarana so th- there is dvitvam here and uh, what is the anuvrutti here you look at it va and yaraha so yaraha dwe yaraha va dwe it goes till 47 so uh, achorahabhyam dwe and anachicha will have yara hand va as anuvrutti and he it is also will see further in the vritti you will see so dwe uh, yara ha and va is the vibhasha so what does this mean here you have achaha panchami and rahabhyam panchami 
यचन वाइजनल एंड द्वे इज वॉट द्वे इज इज ए आदेश सो इट इज इन प्रथमा प्रथमा द्वे वचन द्वे टू सो इट्स इट्स अ ड्यूएल so condition is what you should have an ach you should have an ach ach followed by a refa or hakara and this should in in turn be followed by a year letter by a year letter then what happens this year year can optionally take dvitvam means it will become year 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 as in whatever is the year letter that will be duplicated optionally and what is year year is it starts from hyavara that's where the consonant starts in the maheshwara sutra the pratyahara year will remove hakara from the earlier hyavara sutra and till shasasar in the end and last sutra is hal so last sutra is counted out hal which takes care of the second hakara and the earlier hakara comes in the hyavara sutra therefore all consonants except for hakara that is yar so what the sutra means when an ach uh, when a yar yar letter means when any consonant except hakara is preceded by a hakara or refa which in turn is preceded by an ach a vowel then this consonant can optionally be doubled this is what the sutra meaning is so what this means is this will become so re year is doubled optionally the vyakhyana says achah parabhyam refa hakarabhyam parasya yarah dve vastah de this parasya यरह यर लेटर वा ऑप्शनली स्तह बिकम वॉट द्वे बिकम टू एंड हाउ डिड ही गेट दिस पराभ्याम बाय दी पंचमी हियर सो पंचमी इंडिकेट्स द स्थानी इज दैट विच फॉलोज एंड हियर पंचमी अचह आफ्टर दैट द स्थानी इज देर बट नॉट इमीडिएटली फॉलोइंग बिकॉज रे रे रहाभ्याम इज सेट रे हकाराभ्याम दैट इज ऑल्सो पंचमी सो देर आर टू पंचमीज हियर and they are not in samanadikaranam this is ek vachana this is dvivachana and this is a vowel here you have ref and hakara mentioned therefore uh, there is a sequence ach followed by ref or hakara which is followed by a year letter then year becomes the stani and stani is in shashti anyway ye already given that takes dvitvam example given is example gauryo and vapyeshwara so vapyeshwara is an example for na samase that's a uh, like a vartika it's a vartika we'll see the meaning in samasa it will not be there gauryo is what which we already saw here gauri plus gauri plus au so this gauri plus au we have already derived it as gauryo here it is said here what is gauri plus au then gauryo form you get and here if you apply this sutra rahabhyam what is the condition here gau so gakara is there au au is an ach then you have gauryo refa is there refa hakara abhyam so re, refa is there and then you have what gauryo yakara is there yakara is definitely a year letter followed by whatever it is this is immaterial but th this is also immaterial what is the condition ach this is the condition au ach refa and refa or hakara or uh, followed by year letter condition is satisfied now 
you apply this sutra, Gakara will remain Au, Au will remain Au, Refa will remain Refa, Yakara will be doubled, Yakara will be doubled and Au follows. So, this is the Adesha, this is the Adesha by which sutra, this current sutra, Achorahabhyam Dve and thereby you will get Gauryav, Gauryav. There are other examples also, other examples are, you see in chanting, in Gita chanting also you have not Arjuna Vacha, you have Arjuna Vacha, why Jakara is doubled by the same sutra, Arjuna Vacha, so say Arjuna Vacha, in Gita you see this, what happens, this A is there, Refa is there, Jakara is a year letter. Then Un, na, Una, Arjuna. This condition is met here and thereby there will be doubling of this year letter Arjuna. Arjuna Vacha. It's actually Arjuna Vacha and Visarga and this Ukara, there is another Sandhi and Visarga Lupa has happened. Arjuna Vacha will become Arjuna Vacha. Jakara will double. You also have in uh, elsewhere in uh, if you look at uh, dictionaries you will see karma. So karma, karma karmani karmani. What is this karma? Kakara, akara, refa, makara. So refa, akara, abhyam and makara is there. Here will you see what? Kakara. Akara, Refa and Makara will undergo doubling. Karma and there is an Akara also here, sorry. Akara will undergo doubling. So of, you will get Kar, Karma. You see in uh, old books you will see this form. You will not see Karma, Karma. You will see Karma. So these are other examples. A uh, lot of usage for this. Let me see if there is a Hakara example in Kashika. Yeah. So there is a another example here is uh, say Brahma. Brahma is there or Brahma. Say Brahma itself. <coughs> so Br you have a here, Hakara. So, Ref Hakara. Hakara example is not given in Laghu. Ma. So, here you have Akara. This condition is made. Akara followed by Akara is Ach. Hakara followed by Hakara. Ref Hakara. Abhyam. Hakara is there. And then Makara which is any consonant except for Hakara. And then A. You have Makara and A. So, this condition is met here. Thereby, Makara will undergo doubling. You will get Brahma. Brahma. The Vartika says Na Samase. Meaning, in Samasa, uh, Na Samase, what? This Vartika is not for, uh, it is not for, it is not for this Sutra. This is in the Lagu context. So, there is uh, Na Samase will go with the sequence that we are looking at where earlier we saw hraswa eko as, ekaha asavarne shakalyasya hraswascha so what this means na samase uh, there it means that na sam, samase hraswa adesha na bhavati na samase hraswa adesha na bhavati here so, vap, this is a samasa here. Vapyashwa is a samasa. What kind of a samasa? We will see. Vapyam. Vapyam ashwaha. Vapyam ashwaha is the samasa. Saptami tatpurusha. There is a horse in the pond. So, the, there is a horse. Not there is. 
consider that there is a horse in the pond, that horse will be referred as Vapyashwa. So that, that Ashwa who, who is in the Vapi pond. So therefore Vapi Vapi plus Ni Supratya and then Ashwa plus Supratya. When you derive this, then since this is Kritadita Samasya Pratipadikam, this is Pratipadikam and in Pratipadika there is a Supluk. Therefore, you will get Vapi plus Ashwa. So, Vapi and Ashwa in a Samasa, this e, this e Kara will not take Raswadesha. Why? This is Padanta. Earlier we saw at the end of the Pada, Gauriya, in that Gauriya, Gauri is not at the end of the verse. So now, Padanta Itikim, there we saw the example. In Gauri, Gauri plus Au, the Sutra, Hraswa, which Hraswa Adesha is not applied. However, here, here this is Padanta because Vapi plus Ni, Vapi plus Ni is a Pada, pada and Vapi, this Ikara Vapi, this is a uh, padanta ikara because pratye lope pratye lakshanam although there is a pratye lopa although there is a pratye lopa still pratye lakshana is maintained therefore this ni ni although it has gone which has made this vapi plus ni as a pada still this ikara will remain at the end of the pada even when there is a supluk this ni goes away therefore this vapi is a pada and Vapi Ashwa is also a Pada, although this Su has gone. Therefore, Ikara here should have taken Hraswa. Why? Because Asavaruna. Asavaruna Ach is following and by the earlier Sutra, uh, there should have been a Hraswa if this Vartika Na Samase were not to be there. And thereby, had it taken Hraswa, what would happen? You cannot do further Sandhi. Therefore, uh, Hraswa Vidhi Samartya, you cannot cannot do Sandhi if you take uh, the Sutra and apply it here. But Na Samase, therefore, this will become what? Vapyashwaha. It will not take Hraswa Adesha and when Hraswa Adesha is not there, then you have to do Sandhi and here Iko Yanachi will apply. Iko Yanachi and Hraswa Adesha. Na Samase Samase, what? Hraswaha. And let's write the, the earlier sutra itself. Otherwise, we will not know where does this uh, Vartika belong. This Eko Savarane Shakalase Hraswascha. This will not apply here. The Samase, the entire sutra here. So, Iko Savarane Shakalase Hraswascha Samase Na Bhavati. It is, should not be applied to Samasa. This is a Vartika under, we will say. We will say this is a Vartika under this Sutra. And thereby, next, Iko Yanchi will apply since Hraswadesha has not taken place and you will get Yakara or in the place of this Ikara and Akara, you will get. Uh, sorry, in the place of Ikara, you will get Yakara and you will get Vapyashwa. This Vapyashwa is a Pada now and Vapyashwa is a Samasa which can take Su now and decline Vapyashwa. It's a Pratipadikam and then it can become Pada now. So that is the Sutra. Pachorahabhyam Dve, which is actually a, uh, it is not a, uh, it is not a um, achsandhi really, it is a uh, halsandhi. But it is taken here because Gauriya he had done and in Gauriya he wanted to show the alternate form. Here there is no dvitva needed because dvitva is not possible, refa akara is not there. There is no refa akara. Therefore, this is, this actually, uh, Vana Samase, this Vartika, Vartika Na Samase, this is actually has nothing to do with the Achorhabhyam Dve. 
this has nothing to do with achora habyam dwe so i'll put a dash here this is in continuation of eco savarne eco savarne shakalya se hraswasya this has nothing actually achora habyam dwe was in the uh, was an aside was an aside to, to aside to the context of achandi itself it is uh, an aside but what is in the it in the context of in the prasangika it is prasangika to dvitvam uh, of gauriyav which was in the context of the sutra eko savarne shakalya se hraswasya that is an achandi so in this achandi because hraswa is an achadesha achaha acha eva hraswa bhavati so in this context he gave a counter example gauriyav now he thought that let me finish this gauriyav uh because there may be a question why gauriyo why not gauriyo we see gauriyo form also so there he brought in how gauriyo becomes gauriyo so it was only in the context of the counter example not even the example counter example to the sutra which is of achandi so you have to see it it's a little tricky uh, as to how the sutras come about and uh, where this vartika has come about the last sutra in the atsandhi prakarana is rutyaka i think last sutra so uh, anyway uh, just let me uh, finish in this context there was a question earlier raised as to this nityam word we see in plutha pragriya achi nityam that's where we uh, saw the uh, plutha and pragriya uh, they achi nityam so nityam pragriya sanya is given and then there something happens nityam so the question was asked let me just go back to that sutra okay here see plutha pragriya achi nityam why this nityam word because va we understand va is given as a vibhasha optionally but the question was if it is not given a vibhasha as a vibhasha then shouldn't all sutras be nityam so it's a very valid question however whenever you see this see the word nityam and you uh, especially when you are not studying the ashtadhyayi sequence out of sequence as uh, laghu does that time it is not clear as to uh, what is this an apavada for or what is this a vidhi which is uh, for which there is an apavada which is earlier or later so we can't see the uh, vidhi and apavada sequence whether puru apavada or after uh, after the sutra there is an apavada coming in therefore considering that nityam word is used because something else is going to if not earlier then later some sutra is going to be an apavada and uh, either uh, counter this sutra completely or partly wherever you see so there can be a part of vada also or like making it vibhasha also is possible uh, what is compulsory earlier may become vibhasha later optional later what is uh, going to be compulsory later may have made been made optional earlier that time nityam word is introduced in some sutra because in some particular scenario uh, the, it it may become a vibhasha or that sutra may be countered so here what is it said Uh, what is said plutascha pragriyascha sorry pluta pragriya achi nitya prakrutya so prakrutya ete achi prakrutyasyu so he says prakrutyasyu there is a prakruti bhava and prakruti bhava is nityam here in this case prakruti bhava is nityam and the example is agacha krishna krishna atra gauscharati so krishna atra there we saw this pluta pluta that there is a prakriti bhava and thereby no sandhi and that is nityam in this case now what we saw here what did we see in eko savarne shakalya uh, shakalyasya hraswascha the here there is an option so why is said here uh, this is vartika i am saying this uh, shakalyasya matena vibhasha so shakalyasya mata due to the shakalya mata you get a vibhasha here and asavarna if it is asavarna following ik ik letter asavarna is following then 
it also includes uh, uh, Pluta. That time what will happen? That time it will become Vibhasha here, but in the case of Pluta, the uh, author does not want, Panini Muni does not want Vibhasha in such case. Therefore, this sutra can act as an apuada to the earlier sutra. Therefore, he added Nityam there. Thereby, uh, in cases where Pluta Pragriya Achi Nityam comes into play, that time this sutra will not apply there and it will not become Vibhasha, there Nityam will come into play. So, I just wanted to clarify this because I had kept it open since in this Prakarana, when Pluta Pragriya, the Pragriya section ends, that time I said I will cover it. So, it has ended and this sutra is taken into play to make, uh, bring in the word Nityam in the earlier sutra. So, the last sutra, sutra is what? Hrityakaha. Hrityakaha, Hriti Akaha. Hriti Akaha is the Padacheda. Ruti is Saptami Ekvachana and Akaha here Akaha Kim Bhavati that we have to see, look at the Anuvrutti. So 61128 we have to see what is the Anuvrutti here Akaha Akahasthane Akahasthane Ruti para, para, Parataha or Ruti Pare Something happens. What is that happening? Although we will get in the vritti, which says what? Vritti pare padantha aka pragvadva. Like before. So, pragvadva, vibhasha. There is a vibhasha. Pare padantha akaha. Akaha. Uh, here he is used akaha pragvad syuhu. But aka is the. So, akaha can be. Here it is shashti ekvachana. But in the vritti, he makes padantaha akaha, pragvat syuhu means aka itself is the sthani and akaha remains so. So, therefore, he akaha here is prathama bhavachana. He is not using this, we have seen earlier also, he is not using the shashti ekvachana here. Akaha sthane, akaha bhavati. So, akaha sthane, aka, they remain pragvat. So, no, uh, but as an option, they will remain as they are. Pragvat means Prakriti Bhava. They will remain as they are. Therefore, optionally they will take Sandhi or not. That is the Vritti here. And in the uh, 61128 in the Ashtadhyay, we can have a look. Sorry. My computer has slowed down today. Okay, six one one twenty eight. See, ikaha asavane se raswascha. Then this vartika na samasa is under that. Okay, rutyaka is the next sutra. So rutyaka ha na so uh, not na shakalya se raswascha goes till one twenty eight. So shakalya se raswascha. Rityakaha, what happens? Raswa, optionally it, it takes Raswa. Shakalasya Mratena, Raswa Bhavati, Ruti Pare, Akaha, or if you do not take Shakalya Mata, then it will not take Raswa. So, not uh, Pragvadva, so Pragvadva is Shakalya Saraswascha. So, I said Pragvadva is Prakriti Bhava, I am sorry. It is not Prakriti Bhava, there is no Prakritya Anuvritti here. Shakalyasya. So, this is Pragvat. In the sequence, you have to say Pragvat means what? Like earlier. Like earlier means the Shakalyasya Raswa. Raswa Bhavati. That is Pragvat here. So, Pragvat Va means Pragvat is equal to here. Just mention Pragvat. Pragvat is equal to Raswa. Raswa, it takes Raswa. By Vibhasha. Examples given are what? 
Oh, I, I was going to fill this in. So you have to fill in this Anuvritti of the earlier Sutra. So Shakalya se Raswascha. Shakalya se Raswascha Anuvritti. And Shakalya Matena is given, therefore it becomes a Vibhasha. Examples are Brahma Rishihi. So if the final form is Brahma Rishihi, it has not taken Sandhi. Akara and Ru, Sandhi has not happened. Therefore we can assume that it is it has taken Hraswa Adesha and if it has taken Hraswa Adesha then the word should be what? Brahma. Sorry. The word should be Brahma. Brahma Rishihi, if there is a uh, set of words where you have Brahma followed by Rishi, then Brahma will take what? Optionally it will take Hraswa. Why? Because Asavarna. Asavarna uh, Akara and Ru are have as, do not have Savarnam, Asavarni, Ik and thereby what? You will have Ruti and Asavarna, this Ik was there, in this Sutra Ik was given, but this Akara is not Ik, Ruti Pare, therefore Ruti Pare Akaha, ak, it is not Ik but it is Ak, A is an Ak letter, not an Ik letter, therefore A Ruti Pare, this Ru is following, therefore Brahma, Brahm and A, Ru, A is Ak, Ru is Rut, Rut, Ruti Pare, what will happen? It will take Hraswa. So, you will get Brahma and Rishi. So, Hraswa is the Adesha. So, Akara will become Akara. And then Vachana Samarthyat. Hraswa Vidhi Samarthyat Sandhi na Kartavya. There is no uh, Swara Sandhi. Therefore, Brahma and Rishi. This is how it will remain. Optionally what will happen, uh, this is an optional form or you will get what? Brahmarshi. Why Brahmarshi? Because Brahma and Rishi will take a Sandhi and you will get Brahmarshi. If th this is one possibility, other possibility is what? Other possibility is Brahma, Brahma, Brahmanaha, Brahmanaha, Rishihi, Rishi of Vedas, Brahma also has the meaning of Vedas, so Rishi of Vedas, so this may also be a Samasa and if it is a Samasa then you will get Brahma Rishi, why Brahma Rishi? Because here you will get, you will get the same form, this is what, by, you will have a Guna Sandhi, Brahma Rishi is Ad Gunaha. Ad Gunaha, by that you will get this Sandhi, Brahmarshi. Brahmarshi will become Brahmarshi, sir. Take a Refa Adesha. By Ad Gunaha. Padantaha iti kim. So, counter example. Padanta. Here also you have Padanta. This. Ruti Pare Padanta Akaha. Why Padanta? Because it is in this section. This, this section itself is getting this Padanta. Earlier also we saw Padanta. Padanta I think. So he is giving a counter example now. Yeah, sorry, Anuvritti. There is an Anuvritti in this section, Padanta. So from earlier Sutra. I think uh, uh, this one, Eng of Padanta Dati. 
So we saw Padantad had become Padantasya earlier. So Padantasya, in the earlier sutra also we saw, which sutra this uh, Ekosavarane Shakalya Saraswasya also we saw this Padantat coming from Enga Padantadati had taken Vivakti Parinama had become Shashti Ekvachana Padantasya. Similarly that Padantasya also continues here. Here it continues and you get Rutyakaha. So I didn't mark that Rutyakaha. So Padant Padantat Padantat had become Padantasya. So Padant Padantasya Akaha. Padantasya Akaha Pragva Dvabhati. So Padanta Akaha. Akaha is what Padantaha. Those at the end of Padanta. And this shows that this Aka is used as here. This is not the same Aka. This is Prathama Bhavachana like Padantaha. Padanta is also Prathama Bhavachana. Pragvadva Bhavanti. Bhavanti or Santi. Therefore, Raswaha, Raswaha Bhavanti. Now Padantaha Kim, why Padanta is said is been said Padantaha iti Kim or Padantaha Kim. He gives a counter example. Counter example is what? Archat. A. Uh, actually this is Ru. This is Ru. Rudhatu plus Langlakara. Langlakara tip. When you add this Rudhatu, you add Langlakara tip. Then in Langlakara, you will get actually uh, it's a lengthy process. Let's see how much you can do. So this tip Pakara is it by Halantyam. Halantyam and then Tasyalopa. So I'll just add those Halantyam. Then Tasyalopa goes away. What remains is T. Just so that we don't forget if I can do T. T remains Ruti. Then Ru plus T will become here. The, it becomes the because there is a this naka uh, sutra in three four uh, third chapter towards the end there may be a sutra for all this. Just in the context, I'll show that. So here you see in Nitlakara, uh, Nityam Nitaha. So Nityam Nitaha, Itascha, Itascha, what Itascha? Lopaha Bhavati. This Lopaha, Itascha Lopa Parasmai Padeshu. So Itascha Lopaha Parasmai Padeshu and Nityam Nitaha. Itascha lopa bhavati. So Ikara undergoes a lopa, thereby you get lopa here being Langlakara. So Langlakara you will get uh, and uh, this takes uh, Ruchadesha. It takes Ruchadesha also. You will get Ruch plus actually it takes Ruchadesha only later. This is when shap is added, shap is added plus the so rich plus shap has a, a as its content and takara nityam nitaha. So nityam nitaha itascha lopaha. Sutra is only itascha, I think. Lopaha, or these are Anurutis. And Shap is due to Sarodhatuka. So actually that will be earlier. I'll just add all the sutras here in sequence. Shap is because Kartari, Kartari Shap. 
shap will come in then nityam nita ikara lopa uh, this sutra i still have to hunt so rich uh, the long sutra which gives you rich here sarvadhatuke this is also sarvadhatuke then sarvadhatuka pratyaya follows kartari shap sarvadhatuke and if you keep on going through sutras lot of sutras are needed sarvadhatuka is what thing shit sarvadhatukam therefore this thing pratya is tip pratya sarvadhatuka therefore when sarvadhatuka follows kartari shap pratya bhavati and uh, let's say ru is first gana therefore nothing else or tudadi gana also has ru i think so tudadi gana uh, so you'll get uh, anyway rich is the adesha but what is the importance here let's forget all this let's look at what adesha you get you get the adesha here for our sandhi sutra uh, this sutra brahm this padanta kim this derivation in this derivation ru ruti when ru follows follows what padanta kim here is an example for what ruti pare akaha so ak is not there so far ru is there for ruti ru to become that ru letter which follows something ak has to precede and this ak is here in this case in langlakara you get adagama either you get adagama or adagama adagama is when lung lang lrungshu adudatta there is a sutra adagama applies but there is an apwada to it apwada is what it is uh, adagama uh, for these dhatus which start with a vowel so when they start with a vowel that time instead of adagama they take adagama art and being tit adyanto takito being tit it is added at the beginning of rich so you'll get rich a t adagama आडजादीनाम सूत्र इज आई थिंक आडजादीनाम आडजादीनाम इन ब्रैकेट लुंग अनुवृत्ति लुंग लुंग लंग रुंगशु रुंगशु लुंग लंग रुंगशु अट हो दिस इज अपवाद फॉर अट अडुदात था लुंग लंग रुंगशु अडुदात शु अड अट उदात्ता सो अट इट विल बिकम अड उदात्ता उदात्ता इज ए स्वरा यू डोंट केयर मच फॉर इट राइट नाउ दिस इज सूत्र बट आर्ट इज एन अपवाद आड अजादी नाम अजादी नाम आड होती अडागम होती आडागम होती देर फॉर आर्ट यू गॉट नाउ दिस आर्ट कंटेंट इज आ आ इज द कंटेंट एंड आ इज एन अक लेटर when up is followed by r rut then what will happen our sutra would have applied and thereby it would have given a vibhasha here optionally you can do a sandhi or not do a sandhi had there not been a word padanta therefore padanta it applies this is not a padanta this a is not a padanta ak it is a during the prakriya avastha it is during prakriya avastha therefore in this sutra this uh, uh, in this derivation the sutra does not apply and therefore therefore here you have to do whichever sandhi takes place and here a vruddhi sandhi takes place by atascha there is a sutra atascha vruddhi and vruddhi for art is a itself and then uran rapara will apply we let r no, not uran rapara sorry arch so a itself and then uh, uh, sandhi will apply here and it will make uh not uh, no, this thing it will be uh, refa there will be refa adesha and you will get atascha then archat you will get archat so this is the example archat there is chakara missing here I think it should be archat here i'll leave it there so archat वृक्ष अर्थत 
let me see if I miss something. Atascha Vriddhi. Yeah, so I think uh, yeah, that should be sufficient. So this is uh, the derivation of RC. Iti Atsandhi. Atsandhi Prakarana gets over here. Let's do a quick recap of this Atsandhi. So, Achandi started with the sutra Iko Yanachi, Ika Sane Yanadesha Bhoti, when Achi Pare. So, this is the first sutra we saw. We saw Sudjupasya here, Sudhi and Upasya. In the context, he had brought in, uh, brought in the uh, Paribhashika sutras, Tasminiti Nirdishte Purvasya. Tasminiti Nirdishte Purvasya says what? When Saptami is used in the sutra, then what it points is? The Stani it points to. Stani is that which precedes. Therefore, Adesha is to the Purva. Then Stane Antaratama was uh, introduced here in Prasanga. Prasanga Sati, uh, he said Stane Antaratama. Antaratama is the closest in proximity to Sthana is used when there is an Adesha. So, uh, between an Adesha and the Sthani or multiple Sthanis are there and there is a single Adesha, then uh, which letter should be the Adesha for which? So, their uh, proximity in Sthana, etc. should be taken into account. Anachicha, Anachicha, this is Anachicha Sutra, see 8447. We saw one Sutra. Right now, this is just before Anachicha. The Sutra that we saw, Achoraha Bhyam Dve. Achoraha Bhyam Dve Bhavati, Anachicha. Anachicha also Dve Bhavati. Here, see, you see, Yaraha Dve Vastaha. So, this Yaraha has an Anuvritti here from earlier sutras and the immediately preceding sutra is what we saw today, the second last sutra of the Ashtandi, Achorahabhyam Dve, Refa Karabhyam Dvitvam, Dvitvam Bhavati. Here Anachicha, also when Ach does not follow, so Tasmin Anachi, Anachi Pare Achah Parasya Yaraha Dve Vastha, when there is anach, anach follows. Jhalam Jash Jashi we saw where this Jhalam Jash Jashi. This is also in the context we have seen. Uh, this is Halsandhi Sutra. But in the derivation of Sudhyupasya, that's where he brought in this Sutra Jash Adesha Jashi Pare. Jash letter, when Jash letter follows, then Jhal takes a Jash Adesha. Jash is Vargatritiya. Sanyoganta Silopa also we saw in the same sequence, uh, this in the, of the example of Sudhyupasya, there is Antya, Antya, uh, Sanyogasya Antyaha Lopa Hoti. And here uh, uh, we saw that the Lahu does not cover the uh, Sutra itself, he covers why it does not apply here. Sanyoganta Silopa does not take place here. Uh, he, he had given that example. So, we brought in the Kashika example of Goman. Otherwise, in Sudhyupasya, this Yakara should have undergone Lopa, but he covers the Vartika here, which says, uh, sorry here, Tadantasya. So, Shariyoganta Vyatpadam Tadantasya Lopasya, he left it there. But Vartika said what? Uh, I think he covered the uh, iti prapte, iti prapte he said alontyasya and yanaf pratisheda vachya. He had covered this yanaf pratisheda vachya when yana adisha is given that time this yan if it is at the end of a sanyoga then uh, yanaha lopahana kartavya. Sanyogantasya yanaha lopahana kartavya therefore yanaf pratisheda vachya this he had brought in when iti yalope prapte alontyasya uh, Sanyogantasya Lopa iti prapte, uh, this Yalopa is prapta in Sudhyupasya Yakara Lopa. That time he said Yana Pratisheda Vacha, that Vartika he brought in, and he didn't cover an example for the Sutra uh, Sanyogantasya Lopa, which we had done with Matupantapada. 
एचो यवा यव इज दि सेकेंड संधि सूत्र इन दि अच्छ संधि प्रकरण एव्रीथिंग एल्स वॉज कॉन्टेक्शुअल हियर ही गेव दिस आय एंड आव आदेश आर गिवन वेन अची परे देर वी सॉ ऑल दि फोर एक्सापल्स एंड हाउ दि आदेश शुड अप्लाय टू दि स्थानी देर आर मल्टीपल स्थानीज एंड मल्टीपल आदेश and the number is equal then yatha sankyam anudesha samanam this is the paribhashika sutra as many sthanis are there in the sutra those many adeshas are there therefore one to one uh, uh, this sthani to adesha equation should be made you should make uh, the adesha respectively that is the coverage given here with the examples वांतो ये प्रत्यय वांता आदेश वांता आदेश विचार गिवन अय औव आय एंड आव देर वांता आदेश आर औव एंड आव सो वांत ये प्रत्यय वेन यकार ही इज वॉट यकार आदौ हियर ही नीड्स अ तदंत विधि विच इज एक्चुअली तदादि विधि तदंत विधि एप्लाइज टू ऑल केसेस दि सूत्र विच हैज ऑल केसेस एक्सेप्ट फॉर सेवेन्थ केस विच अ सिंगल लेटर देर फोर इन वांतो ये प्रत्यय he brings in tadadi vidhi and uh, applies that yena vidhi tadantasya and then tadadi vidhi is there yasmin vidhi tadadu algrahani we saw that and he applied that yakaradu so yakaradu vanto ee pratye he had said yakaradu pratye pare vantaha vantaha ee pratye is yakaradu here प्रत्यय परे ओत ओत औतो औ आव एतौ स्तः सो ही हैड सेड यकार आदौ वी सॉ तत् दिस तस्मिन नॉट तस्मिन सॉरी येन विधि तदंतस्य एंड देन वी सॉ दी तदादि विधि अलग्रहणे ओनली व्हेन सप्तम इज देयर एंड अलग्रहण इज देयर अलग्रह सिंगल लेटर इज देयर इन दी सूत्र देन this saptami single letter when it is there that time you do not add tadanta vidhi you add tadadi vidhi so yakarado pratyay pare ot autau ot autau why because av and av adesha are included therefore av and av are vanta vakaranta vanta etau stah that was the sutra covered adeng guna ha guna adesha which is also called as a guna sandhi this sutra is guna sandhi guna is the adesha adeng at e guna ha सो अतें गुण संज्ञा सॉरी नॉट गुण संधि दिस इज अ संज्ञा सूत्र अदेन गुण बिकॉज ऑल आर इन प्रथम एक वचन आद गुण इज इन गुण सूत्र विच इज कवर्ड लेटर तपर तत्काल से हियर अथ वॉट इज अ तपर कर्णम इज कवर्ड वेन तकारा इज एडेड दैट तकारा विल रिस्ट्रिक्ट दी मात्रा ऑफ वॉट प्रिसीड्स एंड मात्रा ऑफ वॉट फॉलोज एकारा इज ऑल्सो रिस्ट्रिक्टेड एंड अकारा इज ऑल्सो रिस्ट्रिक्टेड हियर देन आद गुण दिस इज दि इज दि अच्छी सूत्र गुण गुण संधि सूत्र आफ्टर दि अवर्ण दिस इज नॉट तपर कर्ण दिस इज पंचमी ऑफ अ एंड अ इन्क्लूड्स ऑल दि सवर्ण देर फोर अवर्णा अची परे पूर्व पर एक गुण आदेश पूर्व पर एक आदेश सिंगल आदेश फॉर बोथ दि स्थानी लेटर्स then he brought in this upadeshi janunasika it uh, he had started with halantyam in the sutra here he in it uh, in the sanya sutra he started with halantyam it that's the first sutra in lagu but he, that even that has an anurti of it from this sutra upadeshi janunasika it ach anuna anunasika ach it sanyaka syat and then tasya lopa uran raparah when there is uh, adesha आदेश अण अण आदेश दैट अण आदेश फॉर फॉर रु फॉर रु रु मीन्स उहू उहू इज षष्टी एक वचन ऑफ रु फॉर रु एंड रु वेन देर इज अण आदेश दैट अण विल ऑलवेज बी प्रिसेडेड बाय रे फास र पर अण भवती सो यूल गेट रे फॉर लकारा बेस्ड ऑन वेदर इट इज विच इज दिस स्थानी then we saw an optional uh, adesh of lopa lopa shakalya when you get these 
एचओ दैट टाइम यकारा और वकारा कैन अंडर गो लोप शाकल्य से मत ना देर फोर इट इज अभाषा पूर्वत्र सिद्ध विशाइन त्रिपादी पूर्वत्र सिद्धम दी अर्यर सूत्रास कैनॉट सी दी कार्य ऑफ दी लेटर सूत्रास बट लेटर सूत्रास कैन सी दी कार्य ऑफ दी अर्यर सूत्रास एंड दिस इज ट्रू एक्रॉस दी सेवेन चैप्टर्स एंड फर्स्ट पादा सपादा सप्ताद्यायी एंड पूर्वत्र सिद्धम ऑफ दी त्रिपादी एंड विदिन त्रिपादी आल्सो Within Tripadi also that rule applies. Earlier, as in in Sapada Saptadhyayi, there there is no Purvotra Siddham. They can see each other. However, Tripadi Karya they cannot see all sutras. And in Tripadi, within Tripadi also earlier sutra cannot see the later sutra. Vridhi Radeesh, Vishwadi Vridhi Sanya, and then Vridhi Rechi, Rechi Parada Vridhi Hi Adesha Sya. Then this. Some particular sutras we saw. Eta jhet jutsu. Not get into this in the summary. Some particular sutras. Then we saw the uh, pragriya sanya and then prakriti bhava. In the context we also saw upasarga kriya yoga. What is called as upasarga? Then what is called as dhatu? Bhuva daya dhatu vah. Uh, upasarga druti dhatu also. Particular sutra. That's why he had introduced this upasarga sanya. देन परूप संधि भी सो एंगी परूपम सो पूर्व पूर्व पर एक आदेश भी सो एंड देन परूप विच इज द आदेश परूप एंगी देन एंग फॉलोस अचोन त्यादि टी टी संज्ञा भी सो दी सेट ऑफ लेटर्स इन एनीथिंग स्टार्टिंग विथ दी लास्ट वॉवेल इज कॉल्ड एस टी देन ओम ओम ओंगोश्च देर ऑल्सो ओम आंगोश्च ओम आंगोश्च इन ओम एंड आंग when they follow then some particular karya happens pararupam ekadesha so this is a very particular specific antadi vachya also uh, very particular sutra akas savarna dirga common sutra when the savarna dirga sandhi also known as savarna dirga sandhi when savarna savarnam is there between letters uh, in when ach has savarnam then dirga adesha happens and that is an apavada to earlier sutras which are वर अदर आदेश वॉज टू हेपन दैट विल नॉट हेपन बट दीर्घ आदेश एंग ऑफ पदांत अति अति परे एक आदेश एंग ऑफ पदांत एंड पदांत एंग अति परे पूर्व रूपम एक आदेश देर फोर हरे अव बेकम हरे व अकारा देर इज नो लोप आर एक एंड अकारा आर टुगेदर रिप्लेस बाय दी पूर्व रूप विच इज एक देर फोर यूल सी हरे व देन इन गो शब्द वी सॉ सम विभाषा सम सम मे नॉट विभाषा सर्वत्र विभाषा गो हो गो शब्द पर्टिक्युलर अनेकाल सिद्ध सर्व से ऑल्सो पारिभाषिक सूत्र वी सॉ आदेश वेदर द स्थानी इज अ सिंगल लेटर और द एंटायर दैट वी सॉ निच ऑल्सो वी सॉ विच ब्रिंग्स इन द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ अ सिंगल स्थानी विथ मल्टीपल आदेश और आदेश लेटर्स और मल्टीपल स्थानी विथ सिंगल आदेश और मल्टीपल आदेश सो स्थानी सिंगल लेटर मल्टीपल लेटर्स एंड आदेश सिंगल लेटर मल्टीपल लेटर्स ऑल कॉम्बिनेशन वी सॉ इन दिस कॉन्टेक्स्ट विथ पारिभाषिक सूत्र अवंग स्पोट इज ऑल्सो पर्टिक्युलर अपवाद अदेर इंद्रे चे ऑल्सो अ पर्टिक्युलर एक्सटेंशन दूरा धूते फ्रॉम हियर दिस प्रग्रीय एंड प्लुत दैट सेक्शन स्टार्ट प्लुत प्रग्रिया ची नित्यम वी सॉ दीज संधीज very particular uh, areas e dude dvachanam pragriyam what is the pragriyam sanya for this dvachana eat ut and eat antam other so math we saw this other shabda particular forms there makara paraha what happens then we saw some nipata sanyas for pragriya itself uh, chadeva satve pradaya nipata eka jana do sutra some get this nipat sanya and thereby they can get pragriya sanya among them also and then whatever gets pragriya they will have prakriti bhava they will not take sandhi oath or may take by vibhasha sambuddhau shakalyasya eta vanarshe so itau when iti shabda follows what particular sambuddhi then what sandhi will happen or what will not happen that we saw here maya unyo vova may 
maya unjo wa some particular cases not very important uh, but uh, we see how uh, how detailed the sutras are eko savarne shakla se raswasya we saw only in the beginning of the class we revisited achorha abhyam dev what we saw today uh, the duplication there and this is uh, this section where you have anachit also which has come out of sequence in lagu because he needed it in uh, sujjupasya and ending with rutya kaha ruti pare akaha uh, vibhashaya hraswa bhavati when hraswa happens there is no sandhi when hraswa does not happen that time there is sandhi so this ends the uh, at sandhi prakaran in the next part of tomorrow we will start the hal sandhi sorry for taking 10 minutes more this wanted to finish the uh, summary what happened Mm. sorry i need to go to the shloka vrta vasane nataraj rajo nanna ghatakkan nav panchavaram uddhartu kama sanakadi siddhane ta vimarshe shiva sutra jalam any questions So I'll see you in the next part of tomorrow.